Hi, in this video what we're going to do, I'm going to show you what uh, a volume of revolution looks like. So here we've got a function, and the function is 2 plus sine x between 0 and 2 pi. And what we're going to do, we're going to rotate this round the x-axis, and I'm going to illustrate the, this. So if I click this button here, and we can see and I'll start moving the thing around, we can see what's happening here is that a solid revolution is being formed here in 3D, and rotating the shape around the x-axis. So I can move it around at different angles, you can see like that, and what I get is a 3D shape, like that. Okay, so I've gone all the way around now, I can look, and if I look now, you can see I've got a 3D shape. Okay, and this is called a volume of revolution. And in order to find the volume of revolution, what you need to do is do pi times the integral from 0 to 2 pi. It's 0 to 2 pi because 0 here and 2 pi here of the function squared. And it's not the function squared because it's like pi r squared. And what you do is you're summing all these up from the integral between 0 and 2 pi. And the answer to this is 88.83. Uh, cubic units. Now it's possible to see this animation in 3D uh, so I'm just going to set it back to its thing and with GeoGebra if you select this one here and select this arrow here and the glasses mode which is just there okay and I'll start the animation again so if you now put your 3D glasses on, your red cyan glasses on which go with GeoGebra and press this button here, you will now see the whole thing in 3D. I'll rotate it around. You'll see this now in three dimensions. Okay, exactly the same thing, but in 3D. You can see the shape going around the x axis here, looking at it from different angles. Okay, and uh, this applet I will put in the notes of the video. Okay, and then to take it off 3D mode, all you need to do is click that and then go back to the original one. Sorry, like that. Okay. So this has been a, vid uh, a video to show you how what a volume of revolution looks like uh, rotating a function, the area of a function around the x-axis. Thank you very much for watching.